Assalamualaikum. My name is Muhammad Tokir, and today my presentation topic is plant hormone. Hormone basically is our chemical messenger. Now we discuss it how hormones use in signal transduction pathway. First of all, receptor transduction and response three steps of the signal transduction pathway. In cell wall, a receptors are present that detect the hormones or environmental stimulants. In cytoplasm, signal transduction is occurred that transduction cause small response detector small molecules that cause a cellular response and at the end response that act on hormones or st uh, environmental stimulants now we discuss my presentation topic that is hormone hormone basically is chemical messenger that coordinate the different parts of a multicellular organisms here we discuss some hormones of plants first is oxygen oxygen as we see in diagram oxygen formula this hormone increase the concentration of H positive ions in the primary primary cell wall that activate the enzyme that loosen cellulose fiber due to loosen cellulose fiber cell wall become more plastic and increase target pressure cause the cells to expand here oxygen is produced at the tips of roots and shoots Oxygen also cause a response of light that called a phototropism. Second here plant hormone that is gibberellin. Gibberellin basically is a group of plant hormone that like oxygen promote plant growth. Gibberellin 60 plus types of gibberellin are present and abbreviated as GA1, GA2, etc. They synthesize in young leaves, roots, and shoots that transport to other parts of the plant. Gibberellin basically produced in the roots and transported to short tips interact with oxygen to stimulus short growth. As the gibberellin produced in roots, they move upward on the short tips and interact with the oxygen that cause the shoots growth. Gibberellin also increase the development of seed germination as we seen on this picture. Here is some graphs for, uh, with the help of gibberellin on applying or uh, applying gibberellin in times on roots of grapes. The size of grapes increase Gibberellin also controls the growth of roots with the help of uh, as the gibberellin hormones control they elongate as the roots growth. Third is our cytokinase. Cytokinase is a group of hormones that stimulates cytokinase. Cytokinase is a process of cell division. As we look on a huge big trace and a small newly leaves on trees this process is called cytokinesis second process also occur with the help of cytokinase that is organogenesis organogenesis is a simple in the direction of organ development for example the relative amount of cytokinase and oxygen determine whether roots or shoots will develop me with the help of cytokinase we determine roots or shoot development and the direction also fourth is our hormone that is ethylene as we know ethylene is a gaseous hormone that promotes the ripening of roots in bananas and other foods 
we use ethylene artificially and naturally to ripe the fruits ethylene also involved in the stimulating the production of flowers some flowers need this hormone to grow and produce a lovely flowers in addition ethylene combination with oxygen inhibited that aging and dropping of leaves also occur by ethylene fifth is abscisic acid abscisic acid also known as a growth inhibitor they promote stimulator closing during drought stress when drought stress is occur the uh, abscisic acid promotes stimulator closing it also promote the leaf sensi sense is called aging process when plants go dormant for winter abscisic acid promotes seed dormancy and inhibit early germination dormancy in these seeds is broken by an increase in gibberellin or by other mechanism that respond to cues such as temperature or light with the help of temperature and light dormancy in the seed is broken by an increase with the help of gibberellin here is hormonal functions first is phototropism phototropism is the plant's response to light as we look on this diagram when sun is rise from right side uh, when sun is right side the plant face like uh, sun flowers for example they if they change the position and response to the light second is gravity second is gravity tropism here is the response to gravity by stems and shoots both oxygen and gibberellin are involved if stem is horizontal oxygen produced at the apical meristem moves down the stem and concentrate on its lower side growth of the flower side is greater than that of the upper side and the stem bend upward that uh, process is called geotropism or gravitropism that increase the growth of plants upward on the sky third is next our uh, next year uh, photoperiodism photoperiodism basically is the response of plant to change in the photo periods as we know some flowers growth very well in day mood or some flowers produce uh, produce such or uh, hormones that increase the growth of plants in night mood here is a we simple discussing a plant reproduction in which we discuss now i am discussing a detail of fertilization in which we discuss then a seed germinate our hormones are released that oxygen in or gibberellin and other uh, ethylene in the writing of fruits uh, cytokines that develop the that, uh, that develop the new leaves on trees simply this hour is topic for more information if you want any question please ask me